Welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to be doing a eyeshadow palette review. The review is going to be on the Tammy Times Revolution, I hope, think that's how you say it, Tropical Paradise palette. So she collaborated with Makeup Revolution and made her own palette and it's just absolutely stunning. I'm going to talk you guys through each step on the eyes. I just did the eyes today. But isn't she stunning? Isn't she stunning? Honestly, like, this did this on my eyes, like this palette. So yeah, just keep on watching, you'll know my thoughts on the blendability, the pigmentation, um, and everything else. I think that's what I have to say right now. But um, before I go, I'm going to do my post notification shout out. And today's one goes to Ananya Gosh. Thank you so much for the sweet comment. If you guys want to get a post notification shout out next time, all you have to do is subscribe, press the bell button, and comment below when you have done so. I hope you guys will enjoy the video and we'll jump straight into it. Okay, so I have the palette right here. I'm so excited to try this. This has been just on my desk like for a while now because I just keep putting it off. Um... I thought I would be filming more, but surprisingly, I'm not. It's not that I don't enjoy it. It's just, like, I want to, like, think of really good videos to do. So, yeah, here's the palette. Let me just stop blabbering. Um, this is what it looks like. It, it's got a rose gold front that's reflective. It says Tammy X Revolution. Um, I think that's amazing that you have your name on a palette. Like, that's crazy. Um, and these are what the colours look like. It's very tropical, like, very exotic. When I look at it, it's, you've just got a good option of colours. I haven't actually swatched any of these, so I don't know what the pigmentation is like. I hope it's really good. Um, but I've seen some looks that Tammy has done with this palette, and, like, it, they're just, just so good, you know. And we do have a name sheet. I always lose these, though. I wish, I mean... It's not like we need to know the shades, but sometimes it's helpful, especially when you do like tutorials and stuff. It's really helpful to have like the names on the palette, but I know I'm going to lose this for sure. Um, but she has really cool names. Coconut Cream, Isle, Isle of Spice, Golden Sands, Waterfall, Midnight Stroll, Rich Soil. Alright, so shall we just jump straight into this palette? I'm just going to like swatch it for you, so just a quick swatch. yellow really catches my eye what else should we do so just blue it's actually very pigmented let's see just the blue i mean you can't say those aren't pigmented dang those are very pigmented like obviously you need to like blend them a little bit but I mean, that's pigmented, but I'm really, really going towards like yellows, purples, orange, and a bit of blue and green. Let's try and use as many colors, shall we? <laughs> I love that she has like her basic transition shades right here, um, and you just got a lot of, how many mattes are there? 11 mattes and 12 shimmers, like shimmery shades. Should we do this? I'm first gonna start off with my P. Louise eye base. I haven't used this in a while. I know that she has new shades now and everything and I do want to get my hands on it but I just haven't had the time and it's really hard to get her products like I think they go out of stock a lot and I remember I was trying to buy the darker shade but <clears throat> I just kept having issues like it wasn't showing up I'm gonna do one eye on camera I know I look crazy and I'll do the other one off camera just to not make this video too long so the first shade I think I'm going to go for is that this bright orange right here. And this shade is called Tropical. So you guys know I like to pat and I think with this eye base you definitely need to start off like that. Just look at that. Oh my goodness. Take a clean brush and just soften the edges. Okay, so now that's all softened out, I'm going to grab a smaller brush. I think I'm going to go in with this. 
this shade right here it's like a rich purple I'm gonna go right underneath the, the orange I think I need a small brush because I don't want to like cover the orange I still want the orange to like peep through I can definitely say that I'm very surprised with the pigmentation. The fact that it's coming up as bright on my skin tone and I think Tammy is even a bit darker than me and it shows up very well on her. So you can kind of see the orange and the purple. I'm gonna go in with this brown right here. This one right there is Adventure. This is just gonna go in the inner and outer corner. Okay, so I just used a P. Louise base to cut the center um, to kind of do like a cut crease. So I'm going to go in with the shade Golden Sands, which is the shade here. It's like a beautiful yellow gold. And I'm just going to pop this on the center. Yeah, I'm going to grab Carnival, which is a shimmery bright purple. Blend that on the each side. Try and make sure that your yellow doesn't disappear, so put some on top if need be. I'm going to grab this shade right here, which is a very light champagne colour. This shade is called Pina Colada, and I'm just going to pop this in the centre just to kind of like make it pop. There we go. I mean, look at that blendability. Okay, so I'm just going to finish the rest, pop some lashes on, maybe some eyeliner as well, and I'll be right back. Alright guys, so I just filmed another video, um, like my skin, um, but I did do my lower lash line and I put some of uh, the green and the orange under my eyes. Um, I put a clip here so you can see, so I just put the green first and then I smudged the orange underneath. Um, and then, I think I'm just going to highlight the inner corner, this shade right here, the lightest shimmery shade. I'm going to mix it with the champagne one to the pina colada one. I'm actually living for this eye makeup right now. I love this palette. Hands down. The colour choice is just so stunning. And the way these eyeshadows blend, like, look, just, just look at my eyes. Okay? It looks stunning. So, yeah, that's a close-up of the eyeshadow. It's just so stunning. Look at the pigmentation. Look at the shades. I mean, the camera's not even picking up, but there's purple, like, on each side. Oh, my goodness. And the orange. Oh, she did a really good job and she's really sweet as well um for the price i'm definitely gonna give this palette a 10 out of 10 i actually really 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 like it like i feel like all the shades work on my skin tone like i can use every single shade in here and that maybe that's because she is a woman of color and uh, yeah she's not gonna put something in the palette she can't use so that i feel like that's why i really 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 love this palette because i can use every single shade in here even the transition shades i can use so yeah, I love this palette so much. Definitely one of my favourite palettes so far from Makeup Revolution. Um, definitely beats the uh, Flawless 4 because that was one of my most favourite ones. Um, but this one is just, it just screams me. And you can definitely do like more um, natural looks. Maybe I should do a natural look one day and then get ready with me with this palette. I'm definitely going to be using this palette more. So yeah, I'm so glad I did this video. I had tons of fun playing around with the shadows. Congratulations to Tammy for this amazing palette. Like, oh my god, you did a good job and you definitely know what you're doing. Um, especially for people of colour, because you know, you just made sure that everyone can, you know, use these shades. I think that's all I have to say. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I love you so much. And yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Bye!